Brandon Smith. I was born in Florence, South Carolina. I was raised by both my parents, my older brother, my younger sister. And, you know, as far as my childhood, I would say, you know, for the most part, um, things were, were trying to be as much normal as possible, you know what I'm saying? Um, growing up, there were some things that I did enjoy and things that I didn't enjoy. You know, my family, for the most part, I feel that we were blessed. We was able to have everything that we needed to have. Um, I had a lot of friends that was around my neighborhood. They didn't have as much as we had. So at the end of the day, I consider myself blessed. But on the flip side, um, there was a lot of dysfunction in my family too. It's a lot of things that, that went down and there was a lot of negativity around me as well. And I feel that as a child, I really internalized it. Um, I never really expressed how I felt about where I was growing up at and, and, and the things that were going on around me. And I just really internalized it. When I was around 13, 14, my parents separated. Um, they had a lot of marital issues and they separated uh, by the time I was about to go to, uh, I was in eighth grade, going to ninth grade, and they separated. And um, that, that really hurt me. I didn't know until I got older how much that affected me, but it did. And also my grandmother, um, my, my father's mother, she passed around that same time. And, and me and her, we were real tight. You know, she always spoke life into me. She always encouraged me. She always championed me. So, you know, when, when I lost both of those two dynamics in my life, my life really changed. Uh, me, my mother, my brother, and my sister, uh, we went to, uh, we went and we went our separate ways and my father, he went his separate way as well. And um, that's really what, what led me down the wrong path, I feel. Um, and, and I wasn't a bad kid per se, but the sin in my life graduated. You know, um, when I was 10 years old, you know what I'm saying, I got into the, was looking at the pornography magazines by 15, I lost my virginity by, in my 20s, I was slipping with strippers, you know what I'm saying? So, every everything graduated, I went from bagging up the weed, uh, running with the wrong crowd, to selling the weed, selling the pills, getting pulled over by, by cops in different situations. Um, I went from rapping about guns, to carrying guns, fighting in the nightclubs and everything. So, like I said, I wasn't a bad person, but the things I was into, it, it, it continued to graduate. And that's what sin does, sin graduates on me. So, uh, to fast forward it, you know, to say that I was going through all these different things in my life, music was always my number one. Um, music always kept me focused. I would say um, around the age of nine, I started to freestyle. I started to come up with different flows. I would always grew up around music. My father would always play uh, different different genres of music. It was funk, it was jazz, soul. My grandma, she lived on a dirt road, man. She'd be cooking up Sunday breakfast, bumping gospel tapes. So I grew up around all kinds of music, but really it was hip hop that, that really drew me in and grabbed me. And I began to find my identity through hip hop. So it was around, I was about 16 years old. Um, me and my boys, we got together, we started making uh, mixtapes and we started selling them at school. Um, you know, we started giving them out to our friends. You know, we had, we started doing shows. We had a street team and we was doing our thing. But um, around 2006, it was like the MySpace era. I went, um, I went solo from the group and I became a solo artist. And from there, I really started to take off and I really started to advance as an artist. Um, I've been on tours, I auditioned for BET 106 in part. I've opened up for major artists um, in the music industry. I was independent, I was making money. I was really doing my thing. Um, I moved to Atlanta in uh, 2012. And um, at the time, I was still aspiring to get into the music industry. I was still aspiring for the rap game. But um, things took a turn. I, I found myself compromising a lot in my, in my music and in my content. I felt myself compromising on, on different business deals and different situations, and I felt that they weren't for me, so I decided to leave the, uh, the music industry. Uh, 2015, um, I got baptized in the um, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, and after that, you know, I really just started pursuing God, and, and I wanted to honor God with my life, not only with my life, with my lifestyle, my music, my bank account, um, my friendships, my relationships, everything I did, I wanted to honor God. Another turning point in my life was in 2013, my mom passed away of cancer. And I think that that was a big catalyst for me uh, getting on this path because I had to seek God to deal with that situation. And I feel that uh, at the end of the day, God's will was done. You know, I'm thankful for my mother the time that she was here. You know, I know she's in heaven waiting on me. And I'm just thankful that throughout that situation, I was able to grow and evolve as a person and use this as fuel of my faith and not turn away from the faith. 
So where is Brandon right now? Um, Brandon is just pursuing after God. Um, Brandon has found his purpose in God's kingdom. And he's just pursuing everything that God wants him to do right now. Um, I feel like I found myself. I found my swag. I, I, I found my lane in life. You know what I'm saying? Um, I found my identity in Christ. And now I'm just using all my talents and gifts that God's given me over the years to pour back into the world. Uh, I would say the most important part of that is my new project. It's called Praise My Testimony. And it's basically a, a, a song by song testimony. It's, it's my testimony on wax. And it's just me telling my story of the beginning parts and, you know, the highs and the lows and, you know, the confusion, being lost, being depressed, you know, uh, just, just growing up and going through things. And at the same time, working with God and, and wrestling with God and, and finding out who is God. Does God like me? Is he on my side? You know, just really just going there and exploring who God is and uh, coming into my relationship with Christ. A second part of what I'm doing is right now, um, I'm working with a lot of the youth. I'm, I'm speaking life into the youth. Um, I'm working with like a lot of uh, youth ministries and I'm doing conferences and speaking engagements. And you know, God is just really just opening up the doors. And I know this is just the beginning. So right now I'm just pursuing God, pursuing what God wants me to do. And man, I just hope that my journey is blessed. Each and every person I come in contact with, may God continue to use me. I just hope that everybody just continue to pray for me and cover me. And man, it's going to be one wild ride. Deuce. Y'all ready for a prayer? Yeah! Now when I say praise, y'all say God. Praise! God! Yeah. Praise! God! Yeah. When I say praise, y'all say God. Praise! God! Yeah. Praise! God! Yeah. Go Jesus, go Jesus, go! I praise, I praise, I praise Yahweh, always, always. I praise, I praise, I praise Yahweh, always, always. Pray, hear the praise in the streets. Praise, every praise is unique. Praise, I'ma praise to the beat. Praise, I'ma praise him on fleet. Come on, praise, get it all in together now. Sun shining, ain't no clouds in the weather now. Praise, cause I used to live my life wild. Now I praise God with my lifestyle praise Hear the praise in the streets Do my own thing, every praise is unique Lift up my hands and I praise to the beat All days of the week I'ma praise him on fleet Praise, hear the praise in the streets Praise, every praise is unique Praise, I'ma praise to the beat Praise, I'ma praise him on fleet Come Hands on. up, give him praise, give him praise, hands up Give him praise, give him praise, hands up Give him praise, give him praise, hands up Give him praise, give him praise, God good. Give him praise, give him praise, God good. Give him praise, give him praise, God good. Give him praise, give him praise. Hands up, come on. When I say praise, y'all say God. Praise, God, praise, God. When I say praise, y'all say God. Praise, God, praise, God. Go Jesus, go Jesus, go. Go Jesus, go Jesus, go. Go Jesus, go Jesus, go. Hi everyone, my name is C. Deep David. Uh, I'm born again Christian. I am saved by God's grace. I used to live in the world and now I'm saved. And I, even though I'm in the world right now, I don't need to be or I don't want to be in here, but by God's choice and God's will, I am here serving Him. And I'm very grateful to God that I've got an opportunity to serve Him. It's an amazing feeling to serve Him. And I'm serving as a youth minister at this church, Indian Creek Baptist Church. And God really chose me, made me a teacher so I could become a student of His Word. And that's basically my story because this was the only way God could find to teach me because I'm a businessman. I was so busy in the world. But God said, I am going to make you a teacher so you would have to become a student. So I praise God and I, it's a great opportunity to serve among these teenagers and I come from India and I could have never imagined in my life that I would be working in America with African American teenagers. It's all God's grace and His will and a lot of times I wonder 
what if this is not it then what else this is amazing and I also want to thank my brother right over here Brandon he's been a big blessing to us we met about three or four weeks ago and he does Christian rap and he's been coming here great instrument because I always pray God for to send me young Christian people who can connect with these the souls that are over here we carry a big burden we carry the same burden and I have been a big blessing to me and I praise God for him and his life and I ask you if you believe in Jesus if you're a follower of Jesus Christ and if you pray in the name of Jesus please pray for me because without prayer or without God's strength I am nothing and pray for me that I could be used as a vessel for this instrument for this purpose for this team thank you so much God bless you we are more than conquerors in Jesus Christ so it didn't matter what I went through, I was gonna win anyway. Still we rise. Let's go. narrow the road is rough the devil is down the lord is up doing my best my best not good enough <laughs> rap is a mess my style ain't hood enough <laughs> but i came too far to stop valet parking i've been through a lot see these rainfalls drop that's tears from my eyes then i look up in the sky god what a surprise still i rise I'm more than a conqueror, and nobody's stopping us. Tell them, shout it still, I rise. Life will never be the same, never be the same, never. Still, I rise. The devil ain't beating me, ain't defeated that easily. Tell them, shout it still, I rise. Still, I rise. Lord, help me with these chains that I pray off Just because I got saved Don't mean enemy took a day off Troubles gather a seance Know the blood is gonna spray y'all Never to return The lake of fire shall burn It's my turn So I'm rapping with the passion of Christ And through God, I change the way You think that rappers be like On the mic, I'm an evangelist Testimony through damages Praying for all my savages Resurrected like Lazarus Still, I rise I'm more than a conqueror Boy, ain't nobody stopping us Tell him, shout it still, I rise. Life will never be the same, never be the same, never. Still, I rise. The devil ain't beating me, ain't defeated that easily. Tell him, shout it still, I rise. Still, I rise. Fly away. Uh. We shall overcome. Deep in my heart, I do believe. We shall overcome. together to sing it, but we still decided to sing it. We will be able to rise. We smoking alcoholic, man it depressive. Was broke half my life, nothing changed in the recession. I've been through it. I've been through it. Doctor said I had HIV. Months later, found out it wasn't me. I've been through it. I've been through it. Mama got cancer, I'm praying to the skies Bargain with God and she still died Look, shout it, I been through it I been through it Even when I wasn't enough Jesus held me up, covered me in his blood I been through it I been through it
It's Brandon Smith. I'm a dynamic communicator, artist, and a youth minister. And I thank y'all for checking out my testimony. And you know, the sad thing is, today's youth is still dealing with the same things that I was dealing with as a youngster growing up. We're still dealing with sex outside of marriage. We're still dealing with depression, suicidal thoughts, gang violence, drug and alcohol addiction. And I feel called by Jesus Christ to be a gap in the plant season to the youth. If you would like to contact me for your next event, you can book me at bookbrandonsmith at gmail.com. You can reach me on my official website at rapperbrandonsmith.com or follow me on social media at rapperbrandonsmith. I look forward to serving you and pouring life into your youth. Bless up. Still I rise. The devil ain't beating me, ain't defeated that easily. Tell him, shout it, still I rise. Still I rise.